couple of them by the Chinese on you. On you, I was like, you're going to be crazy, uh, David. Well, he got rid of it. Uh, then he started to fade out. So, and yet Jim and Mike could not uh, hear each other. Uh, okay, all right, over to you. And then it would go back to uh, Mike. And what is the latest on Tom uh, Hart? Uh, how did he make out uh, with that tower situation if he did it? And uh, was Ryan there? K1, why you are, you are skipping over K1, Z, Z, L, I think. Okay, Charlie, uh, K1, Z, Z, L. Okay, well, why do you? Yeah, he's skipping. Well, Charlie, to answer your question, I haven't the foggiest idea. What? What? Anyway, Rob, have a wonderful evening. Congratulations on your antenna there. You're doing a good job. And enjoy as much you can. Eh, sabiendo bien la situación que Hello YouTube Preppers, this is the Comms Prepper, and this is episode 3 of my new playlist here on the channel, Bench Mess, and this week's mess is pressing the new ICOM IC7300 Software Defined HF and 6 meter transceiver in the service here in the shack. I relocated the IC7200, cached that out at the retreat location with the Falcon 2 surplus military bag. And now the 7300 is going to assume its role as the primary HF radio up here in the shack. Out of the box, the radio passes the manual test. And for me, the manual test is getting operational without using the manual. So I haven't really looked at the manual yet. We're going to start doing that this week. This is the basic manual. On the CD, there's an advanced manual that allows you to drill down deeper into the capabilities of the radio. I want to get through this manual first before I go to an office store to get this manual printed off and put in a binder for me, and then we'll get through the advanced manual. My objectives this week with the IC7300, of course, are to master the basic functionality and get the digital side of the house up and running because you know I like to do my HF radio email. So I have the cable here for the Pactor modem to connect to the back of the IC7300 and hook that up to the SCS modem there. We're going to get the software installed because you can control this radio with your PC. ICOM provides that software here in this CD. So with the USB cable, you can communicate with this radio, have all this display up on your computer. So if you want the screen to be a little bigger, you can do that and put that up on your PC. This radio is packed with amazing features, too many to cover in a few videos here on the channel. So I'm going to create a new playlist called the ICOM IC7300. And as I learn to navigate and operate this radio, I'll make videos along the way and share with you guys. I'll post those videos to the playlist. And we'll wrap up episode 3 of the new playlist here on the channel, Bench Mess, with the introduction of the IC7300. I'm really looking forward to learning what this radio can do and share it with you guys here on the channel. Thanks for watching, guys.